Hiya folks, so I have a truly, truly ancient battle for you today. This battle was, re um, I had this battle back in, jeez, January, back when I first got into black and white battles. Uh, my opponent is IB Scoot, who I met on Smogon, um, and anyway, uh, he leads off with his Nido King. I have no idea what to think of this Nido King because, I, again, I haven't done black and white battles before. This was my first day of black and white battles. Um, and so I didn't know that they ran Sheer Force intended to be offensive. I was thinking, oh, it's probably going to set up Stealth Rocks. Um, anyway, it gets me down to my Sash. Um, I get to, uh, yeah, so, um, I'm going to go ahead and just call it back at this point because, well, it's taunted, I figure it can't set up Rocks. Not that it could set up Rocks, but not that I knew that at the time. And I go ahead and, and send out my Kragnall, who I figure can wall it. Um, unless it runs Fire Blast, of course. Uh, yeah, I mean, all this is hindsight, but it, luckily it didn't run the Fire Blast. Goes ahead and switches out. He switches into his Weezing. I'm not sure what he was expecting me to do, but this Ice Beam actually does a fair chunk of damage. Um, yeah, Kragonal is a really cool Pokemon, and I really wish I could have used it more, um, but it just wasn't really cut out for OU play, at least not the way I was using it. I've seen people use it as a dual screener, but it was here as a Dragon Killer, and it just really didn't cut it as a Dragon Killer. Um, anyway, he switches out his Reuniclus. Uh, um, Ice Beam is not really doing too much, and I'm fearing the Focus Blast, because that much I did know that I see I saw a lot of Reuniclus's that ran Focus Blast. So I go ahead and call it back and send out my Galvantula, um, which I figure can do a fair chunk of damage with um, Bug Buzz. Anyway, he goes ahead and uses the Focus Blast. I resist it, so that was an excellent, excellent switch for me. Doesn't really do too much, and I'm obviously going to be faster, so I mean, I'm actually expecting him to switch out at this point, um, because, you know, he knows what's coming, and it's going to be super effective and all, all that. So I go ahead and go for the Bug Buzz. Does a whole heap of damage. Um, and I'm like, alright, you're going down, Rionicles. But no, he survived with what must have been like 1 or 2 HP, and I'm like, oh no. And now he's going to go for the Psy Shock, uh, and that is going to kill me. Um, I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's going to be enough to kill me. And so bye-bye, Poop. Um, yeah, sad pandas. Um, and he gets off some leftover recovery, but he's down to really low HP, so I figure, okay, that's okay, HCHB has priority, Aqua Jet can finish him off. Not, I actually think that HCHB would have outsp outsped this, uh, Reuniclus. Reuniclus's tend not to run, um, any speed IVs, but I managed to take it out, and so that's great. And so now he sends out his, um, Dawn Fan, I'm like, oh, this is awesome, I'm at full HP, I can go ahead and go for the safe, um, Shell Smash, and so this is going to be totally awesome. I'm going to be able to, you know, hopefully do some damage to this guy. Um, so, yeah, have my defenses, um, double my attacks, all nice and good. Um, he goes ahead and sets up Stealth Rock at this point. Uh, you know, make, uh, makes sense. Uh, kind of late in the game to be doing Stealth Rock, I, I figure. He goes ahead and Ice Shards here, which is an interesting move. Uh, I actually decided to go for the Shell Smash here again. Um, yeah, so he breaks my he breaks my sturdy here. Um, yeah, and I do run sturdy, not um, what you want to call it, solid rock. Uh, so get my defenses halved. Uh, I guess my, now I'm down to one third defenses and X three. Um, no, sorry, I guess it's only down to half defenses. Yeah, uh, shell smash is actually a really awesome move. Um, but unfortunately, leftover does not bring me back up to sturdy range. I'm gonna go ahead and use aqua jet because. Um, of all the attacks I have, I think that's the one that's going to do the most damage. Yeah, it's um, base 60 times 2 for special uh, for uh, super effective. Meanwhile, Earthquake would have been um, base 100, uh, not uh, special. Yeah, anyway, he goes ahead and Earthquakes me, and with all my uh, defense drops, that's going to be able to KO me. Yeah, by, so, sorry, by the way, I know Aqua Jet is base 40, but with stab, it's base 60. That's what I was trying to say. Anyway, he survived my Aqua Jet and KO'd me, so I, that is just so sad. I go ahead and send Tear back out. Um, I'm thinking, you know, he's probably going to switch out at this point since I can uh, resist his super effective, or resist his um, moves, um, either Ice Shard or Earthquake, and I'm going to go ahead and actually go for the Rapid Spin to clear entry hazards. Um, and that's going to be awesome for me. Um, so this is Blaziken, back before it was banned, so I don't want to see any comments that say, Why is he using Blaziken? That's banned! Small gun banned him! Um, yeah, so anyway, I send out Ikea predicting the fire attack. He instead goes for the Swords Dance. Um, and this is a speed-boosting Blaziken. I know it's banned. Please don't comment to that effect. Um, sorry, I don't know why I'm being such a jerk. Um, 
uh, he's gonna go ahead and go for the Stone Edge. I don't know why I didn't, why I thought that he wouldn't run Stone Edge. Of course, uh, he runs Stone Edge. Again, this was like my first day of battling um, with this team, so I was really stupid and naive at this point. Didn't know what I was doing. But it's kind of just fun to look back on back when before you know certain things were ha happening in the metagames and before there were UU and RU tiers. Uh, so anyway, I go ahead and send Tier back out. Not anything I can do. He's going to go ahead and uh, Flare Blitz. And that's of course going to KO. I mean, again, I'm running plus defense nature, um, 252 defense. That's not going to save me. Um, Cryogon has awful, awful defense. And that's kind of the reason why I took it out as the first change I made to this team. So now I've got nothing to do. Um, this game is practically over. Um, I'm going to go ahead and send out River, my um, Mind Show. Um, but and even though it's Scarfed, had I sent it out sooner, maybe I could have done something. But it's Scarfed, and it's not going to be enough to outspeed a plus, what is this, two now, Blaziken? And so Blaziken uh, KOs me quite easily. And this is not going well, although he's now down to fairly low HP thanks to um, all the recoil he's getting. So I'm thinking, well, maybe I can KO him somehow, some kind of magical uh, way. I uh, go ahead and send out Jufro. Um, had it been running uh, Stun Spore at this point, I could have actually maybe done some good, maybe got some hacks. Instead, I'm forced to use Leech Seed. What the hell, Leech Seed? And he's going to go ahead and superpower me for the kill and for the win. So that was a really sad battle, and I think you can kind of see now why I waited until now to upload it. Um, but yeah, kind of interesting to look back on the metagame as it was um, back before, you know, Blaziken was banned and whatnot. So anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed that. Comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. So long, folks.